Today we are celebrating this beautiful woman's 26th birthday. We're here at the Four Seasons in Ubud. And uh, we're gonna share with you what it's like to stay here because this is one of the most beautiful hotels on this planet. And you're not gonna believe how we got here. Happy birthday! I have no idea what's going on. We are going to the Four Seasons in Ubud. <gasps> Really? Yeah. I've never even seen it. This is the perfect place to be for my birthday. Isn't it crazy? We met when I was 23 and now I'm 26. We were just saying like what's changed since we met and when Ruby and I first met we were like drinking tequila, we were partying. Right. Now Ruby complains about digestion <laughs> and I turned 30. You're leaving your 20s dude, no. like you're, it's gone. We're going right. on a kayak? We're camping! Wait, really? What is going on? <laughs> this is everything that I've always wanted to do! Mm -hmm. Oh, that's what we're doing. Oh. We're going rafting. Yeah. Oh, I'm excited. Literally, as soon as Ruby went to change in the car, these guys just park right there. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure they enjoyed got a that. Show, for sure. <laughs> Ruby, how long have you been asking me to do this? Uh, probably for like the last two years. <laughs> I've been wanting to do this forever. 300 stairs later, we're down. Hey! <laughs> There's our boat. The last two days in Bali have been some of the hardest rains I think I've ever seen here. And so to go out on the river right now, I think it's gonna be extra crazy. Don't you need to like be an expert or something before you do this? Like I'm shocked that people can just go do this. He's the expert. <laughs> if you fall in, look for him, not me. Really, really fun. My adrenaline is like pumping right now. How are the rapids today? Uh, not too strong, but good. What a way to start your day on your birthday. 26 is looking good. Yes, it really is. Outside waterfall. Oh, really? Waterfall. <gasps> wow. wow. That's a boom boom. You heard them. Their words, not mine. The limbo action. <laughs> we made it. Yeah. Nothing like really nice, beautiful hotels surrounded by nature that gets me like going. What a welcome. Thank you so much. Look at that. I got a little happy birthday. Birthday coffee beans. Every little detail is so cute. Oh god. How many boyfriends? What? <laughs> We're gonna have a nap. Can you believe that? They actually have an organized nap at this hotel. That's exactly what I need right now. So we were given an itinerary. I don't really know what we're doing right now, but it says 60 minutes of suspended napping in a silk cocoon. Wow, good to see you. My name wow. is Vera, I will be your babysitter for secret nap. Perfect. <laughs> this is gonna be awesome. Mm -hmm. This is exactly what I want for my birthday. Most beautiful baby in the house. <laughs> <laughs> Fera was our mother for just a moment in time. <laughs> she sang to us, we swung in these womb-like structures, which is I... quite fitting on your birthday. Yeah. Oh my god, I had the best time. Thank you for being good, baby. Thank you. <laughs> so now we're gonna head to our villa. I have not actually ever seen these villas before. Let's go check it out. I'm just gonna say it. We gotta normalize adult naps. So this is how you get to the villa? Yes. Okay. This is really nice. Oh wow. Oh my god, we have the best view of the river. This is amazing. Happy birthday to <laughs> Thank you. Thank you 
sir. So tonight we are here at Sokasi. Wow. Hello, chef. This is uh, already a very unique and memorable experience. We're in this tiny little restaurant only made to seat a few people and we're having a seven course meal tonight. It's all gonna be prepared right here in front of us. It's all Balinese family style. So I'm really excited to be taken on this journey. If I had a Balinese mom, this is how it would have tasted. Wow. But instead I got pierogies. Fresh ingredients, not too done up, perfect amount of soft spices, down to the basics in the best way possible. And it's also local, so they use all amazing spices like shallots mm -hmm. and lemongrass and it just like tastes like a breath of fresh air. A truly exceptional meal. Thank you. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Literally. Housekeeping. Housekeeping. <laughs> Oh, no, 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 it's not for you. There she is. Everyone at once, go jump on her. Happy 26th birthday with our best friends. <laughs> Everyone just left. Ruby has been in here the whole time getting a IV treatment. We're probably not going to order Thai food from that restaurant we had in Changu. Even me, immediately after it, I didn't feel great. Sometimes things don't go to plan. But uh, grateful nonetheless to have this beautiful place to call home for these three nights. I mean, hey, if you're going to be sick, if you're going to be going through the thick of it, it's better to have this. This might just be the ultimate spa. Surrounded by a pond, there's lily pads everywhere. So I've actually never started my treatment this way. We're doing like a meditation opening ritual and it starts by identifying what you're bringing that's weighing you down right now. Maybe it's sadness, anger, fear, anxiety. Already, I'm feeling more relaxed than I was. Got a lot on my mind right now with a few business things, so it's definitely a little bit of a weight that I carry. I was like, what, what do we do with this? Do we put our face in there? She's like, no, you sit on it. <laughs> okay. What's the expression, like blowing smoke up someone's ass? <laughs> Is this a great moment what, to mention that Ruby smoke? has a <laughs> stomach bug? <laughs> We're activating our root chakras right now. Absolutely amazing massage. So this is really cool. There's this large platform at the very top of the main building and up here is just a giant 360 of lily pads. It's like being on a floating pond and we have this romantic spot to ourselves. So I'm actually working out six days a week right now and I've done it for the last five weeks, already seeing some pretty cool results. And I gotta be honest, whenever I go to a nice resort hotel, I never go to the gym, even when they have an amazing one. I go into relaxation mode. But the good news is I started my day here. I'm ready to eat whatever I want. <sighs> The key to a happy life as a creator is good health, good routine, and good equipment. So if you've been watching my channel, you guys already know about this awesome laptop right here. This is the MSI Z17, and it is a powerhouse, a wheelhouse for creators. You've got this beautiful 17-inch display. It has a touch screen. It's got some incredible CPU, GPU power that allows you to get through 8K renders like it's butter. This thing has ports for days. USB-C, USB standard, and even an SD. SD card slot, which, let's face it, we hate dongles. Sometimes I'm working from a place like this, and sometimes I'm working in a place like this. This laptop has a 90 watt hour battery life built right into it, which means I can do my photo edits, my video edits, or quite literally anything I want from wherever I want. Most of my business is done right here on a laptop, and so I love the fact that this computer is extremely wide, giving me a massive trackpad, a whole numeric keyboard, and it even has a built-in finger ID, which allows me to quickly and securely access my computer. Whether you're a digital nomad, a content creator, or you just need a powerhouse of a laptop, the Creator Z17 by MSI is is just gonna be linked down below. Check it out and see what this laptop can do for you and your workflow. There's two main restaurants that I wanna show you guys. There's the one that you can actually see right there and then there's the Riverside one. This right here is one of the most beautiful spots at the resort. What I love about it is there's actually two different pools. They're both on different levels. Pretty much only one thing to do here. Here is 
Ayung Terrace restaurant. So it's kind of in the middle of that oval structure, overlooking the whole jungle. It's so incredible. So this morning, we're starting our day right here in front of the hotel. It looks like a hobbit home. It does, it does. You got I love like how there's like running water. Yeah. Right now I can smell all of the amazing foods. They're freshly preparing it right there over the fire. Everything here is beautiful natural ingredients. If I could dream of living off the land and having this level of luxury, this is what I would do with my life. I'm gonna get a whole bunch of onions. I know you hate me, but I'm gonna do it anyways. <laughs> What's in there? Fresh coconut water with lemongrass and mint leaf. Yeah, it's really refreshing. So how are you feeling this morning? A lot better. A lot better. Mm -hmm. Last time we went away to a really amazing hotel, the same thing happened. Ruby and I both got super sick. You know, it's just part of life. You can't control when it happens. But today's a new day. It's really good. What is it? I think it's like coconut shreds mixed with more coconut. Kind of tastes like apple crumble pie. That does taste like apple pie, but a healthier version. This Eggs Benedict's like nothing else I've ever had before. They just brought us out these freshly prepared Balinese pork some prawns. This, for example, is like a savory oatmeal in a Balinese way. I really love it. That was an amazing lunch. I'm so full. I'm so full, but it was really good. I've actually been trying things I never even knew existed in the Balinese cuisine, so yeah. that's really great touch. I loved it. This is the best thing about being here. You have the river that wraps around the whole property. And I really dig how they've actually designed their whole landscaping. I think it's such a creative touch. It just makes you feel like you're in this like fairy tale set. And we made it back. What I love about the design of the villa is you've got this upper deck. It's a really stunning part of the home. But what I think is so unique about this villa experience is most of the time you have these built up walls to create privacy. But because you go down that stairwell into your villa, this entire lower side is completely private. There's this little jungle wall there of plants. You have absolutely no one that can look in. So today, we hung out by the pool, got in some beautiful sun, and tonight, they have the Balinese traditional music show. That's what you hear right now. Wow, I was not expecting there to be so many people when I came around that corner. But this is uh, one of the more unique spots you can get a cocktail. This whole bar is just incredible. And with the live music, it's a real moment right now. Good morning guys, our final day here at the Four Seasons Ubud and we started it off with the sunrise. One last thing I'm going to enjoy is the 34 degree temperature here in the pool. They've actually got a heated pool and we asked them to crank it all the way up. So with our final day, we have a few things we got to show you. We got to give you a room tour. I don't know about you guys, but like I'm always fascinated by how hotels express themselves and uh, the first thing I've noticed and loved is like the hardwood flooring. It's all throughout the home. Even the roof line has like this inverted slope. It's got this really beautiful look to it. It just makes you really feel like you're in the jungle. I love this like almost paper mache light. It creates this really nice texture. But the thing that stood out the most is behind the bed. I love the way they've done these intricate wood carvings. They've actually got full lighting control over it. So in the evening, it creates this really kind of romantic, moody glow in here. Actually, the person that did the lighting for the Four Seasons here is the same person that's doing the lighting for Lost Villa. So really excited about that. There's a lot of attention to like the decor and bringing in that really cool refined feel. I love the way they've done these tables. So they've got like these two different tiles side by side. Together they create this beautiful pattern. You've got this massive bathroom slash walk-in closet. I mean, you've got like basically a room dedicated to your luggage. But the thing that I've enjoyed the most is that right there. I love a good bathtub. From there, you've got a little outdoor area to complement your indoor shower. So you got two showers you can choose from. And this just opens right back up to our beautiful patio lounging area outside here. Not too bad at all. So we arrived on a raft and we're leaving in a Gojek. Life's exciting like that. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, hit the subscribe button and let's get lost in the next one.